it's Ricky Lee here on Ricky Lee TV and for today's video I'm just going to be telling you guys about the Smile Brilliant Whitening Kit. I am so excited to do this video. I have been waiting so long to finally give my full formulated opinion on this product which will be brutally honest. And thank you so much to Smile Brilliant for sponsoring this video. Uh, just a little disclaimer, all of these opinions are my very own. I will be brutally honest about my experience with the product. But with that being said, let me just break down the way this video is going to work. For the first half of this video, I will be providing an informational on exactly what the product is about, the ingredients, just answering a lot of the questions that many people have about this product and whitening products in general. And then I will be providing my very own experiences with it, how I liked it, how my teeth agreed or disagreed with it, my sensitivity levels, all of those things. And then I will be providing a very, very awesome demo at the very end of this video on how to formulate your personal trays for this product, for them to make your trays and for you to start your whitening process. And make sure to stay tuned to the very end of this video because I will be having a giveaway. Someone at home will be able to whiten their smile for free with all of these awesome goodies that are part of this Smile Brilliant Whitening Kit. So let's just stay tuned to the very end of this video. And I also have a coupon code for the rest of my lovely subscribers. You guys will have an exclusive coupon code for you to be able to go on their website and order your very own Smile Brilliant Whitening Kit. So let's just get right into this video. So I'm first just going to be showing you guys what exactly comes within your Smile Brilliant Whitening Kit. It has three sets of the base and the catalyst that you are supposed to mix to formulate the hardening um, cast or like mold for your trays. And it comes with two trays for you to actually create the impressions. In order to hashtag smile fearlessly, you have to be willing to do this process whenever, however you wanna do it. Because with like the charcoals and the charcoal toothpaste and things like that, it can get really messy and you can't whiten your smile outside of your home. But with these products, you can be on the road, you can be driving, and you can be whitening your smile. And what's so great about it is that there isn't a specific amount of time that you have to do it. So there's no reason for you to be really scared or really nervous about whether or not if you need to hurry up and take it out or if it's gonna like knock your teeth out. It's not like that at all. There's an allotted amount of time that you are allowed to do it. It's not recommended to whiten your smile um, for over three hours, but you can go to a maximum of three hours and a minimum of 45 minutes to get the best results. According to your sensitivity, that will determine how long you keep the whitening gel on your teeth for each session. A lot of people say that they see results within one session, and I know personally for me, I didn't see results within one session, but after doing it multiple times, it's definitely worth it. So. With that being said, I'm just going to start talking about the ingredients, the active ingredients that are within these products that are so amazing and that sets it apart from many other whitening and brightening kits. The teeth whitening gel that you're going to be using as your first step contains carbamide peroxide, which is the whitening agent, and the product within the syringe is like a proprietary uh, gel formula. Uh, just so that they can ensure that it covers the entirety of your teeth when you're whitening because the last thing that you want is to not cover the entirety of your teeth while you're whitening because then you'll be left with spots and that is the exact opposite of what you want. So each syringe of the desensitizing gel contains 15% of the potassium nitrate, which is going to help with the anti-hypersensitivity of your teeth and so that it can close the pores of your teeth after the whitening process. And then it also contains 0.15% of the sodium fluoride, which is going to help with the stain prevention. And because the sodium fluoride and the potassium nitrate are both active ingredients within the desensitizing gel, it is able to stop micro fractures within your teeth or like to block the pores from absorbing anything else to like stop staining and help with the sensitivity obviously because it's the desensitizing gel but they do have two options you can order the sensitive whitening gel or the anti-sensitive whitening process so whichever one will be geared better for you if you know that you have highly sensitive teeth when you get out into cold air and you breathe in and your teeth kind of get that shock you need that sensitive 
teeth whitening process. At the end of the day, this is your process, this is your whitening experience, and I want it to be as comfortable as possible, as does Smile Brilliant. So you need to make sure that you go to your dentist and ask them if this will be a good option for you, because the thing about the Smile Brilliant process is that this is the same exact type of process that your dentist will try and do for you at three times the cost. And I know a lot of my viewers are 15, 16, 17, just around that high school age, and you guys are looking for that really easy process that you can do. I mean, you honestly can do this at school. It is actually cruelty free. There is no animal testing involved within these products, so it is actually a cruelty free product. Yes, this product is 100% vegan. It sadly is not recommended for pregnant women just because of the chemicals that are within the products, but as soon as you are no longer pregnant, you can brighten and whiten your smile. You cannot use this with your Invisalign trays just because the Smile Brilliant trays are curated perfectly for the smile brightening process just because they are a bit more flexible and they allow a lot more of um, flexibility and for the coverage of the liquid to be a lot more seamless rather than a rigid hard retainer like the smile bright kind of like retainers that are really hard and plastic this product is absolutely for you if you are over the age of 12 and you are looking to boost your confidence and if you're looking to just simply brighten and whiten your smile I definitely saw a slight difference in the whiteness of my teeth I definitely will be doing a lot more sessions with this product because with any product comes um, patience and time for you to see results. I did 10 sessions personally myself and I do see a difference within the brightness of my teeth as I am an avid coffee drinker with all the rigorous courses that I am taking at my high school. It is very important that I'm highly caffeinated in awakened class. So I do drink a lot of coffee and that is a huge stainer with, you know, your teeth. So I do definitely think that this product is for you. I do definitely think that you should spend your money on it. And I do definitely think that you should use my coupon code. bottom impressions done we're going to just allow our impressions to sit for just 30 minutes and then you will be able to rinse them thoroughly so that you're not sending like nasty impressions to the lab because you know they don't want to touch your spit so you're gonna rinse them off allow them to sit for 30 minutes and then you will package them and they will be ready to go and remember not to remove your impressions from the tray you want to keep the impression within the tray so that they are able to remove it the proper way at the lab and that is all for this demo Okay, and I also have a video on how exactly to use the products, which I will be rolling for you now.
Hey guys, so today is day one of my Smile Brilliant journey. So I just got my kit, well my trays in the mail yesterday and I just popped them in my mouth. Very comfortable. I feel no discomfort and that's really good. I'm about to put the whitening gel within the trays and do some a push homework and then I will let you guys know how it felt and my honest opinion on it in about 30 minutes. It says that you can leave them in for 30 minutes to 3 hours. I'm probably just going to do 30 to 45 minutes today and then we go up to an hour tomorrow, an hour and a half, and so on and so forth and just let you guys know how my teeth deal with the sensitivity and all, the sensitivity and all that kind of stuff. But I hope you guys enjoy this how to be confident series because today we're, we're working on the things that we can change and we're also working on the things that we cannot. So I am back now and I have just finished the whitening gel and I just put the, the sensitizing gel on my teeth and I personally don't really like the taste. The taste is quite disturbing. I mean, I'm not like a big chemically tasting kind of gal. So if you like that, you know, it may work for you. But I kind of messed up. I didn't make sure that the whitening gel was completely spread out over my teeth so it created this splotchy whitening um kind of experience for me so next time i'm going to try a different technique on placing the whitening gel actually onto the tray so that it can actually you know spread out evenly over my teeth and whiten them in its entirety so it is now day three with the trays and I'm absolutely loving it. I did it on Monday, I didn't have school, so I did it for about an hour and a half, and my teeth are doing really well. There's not a lot of sensitivity, so that's awesome. Um, yeah, it's, it hasn't been really bad for me at all. Um, I've just been sitting around doing nothing, FaceTiming my friends while it's been sitting in my mouth, and I actually was able to talk really well so I'll probably end up going out tomorrow with these in just whitening my teeth just because again the sensitivity isn't bad they're also very comfortable and I'm getting better and better at talking with them in my mouth so it's not that bad and I finally figured out how exactly to apply the gel inside of the tray so that it gives me that even polished whitening finish and I've also noticed that as the day that as the days go on, you can't really notice the whitening. So now we're gonna get into all the rules that apply to applying to the giveaway. The giveaway was sponsored by Smile Brilliant, of course. They were nice enough to offer one of my subscribers their very own Smile Brilliant kit, so you will get your own kit in the mail. And I will be there to guide you step by step through the entire process. I will be your personal guidance counselor throughout this entire process. I will tell you what you need to do, how you need to do it, and you can always refer back to this video if you need to just see the demo on how to do it, of course. But yes, so all that you have to do to enter the giveaway is to follow me on Instagram at rickylee.co and make sure that you're subscribed to this channel and turn on the notification bell so that you're notified whenever I upload a new video. But to win the giveaway, to win, to have a higher chances of winning, all you have to do is share this video with one of your friends and show them how to whiten their smile. And obviously you can give them my coupon code so that they can get one for themselves as well. And you'll be able to show them because when you win the giveaway, obviously you can show them what they need to do and you can show them your results. And that's all that it takes. Um, that's all for this video. Uh, let me know if you guys like these kind of videos, if you want me to stay away from these kind of videos. I personally don't mind them that much because there's nothing wrong with trying out new products, you know, and giving your honest opinion on it because people need our opinions, you know. So that's pretty much all for this video. Don't forget to vote, post, and subscribe. I love you guys, and I will see you in the next video.